Alright, so good day mga ka-newbie. So today I'm gonna show you kung paano bumili ng uh, Binance, Binance Coin, Binance Coin or token gamit ang iyong Gcash or Paymaya. So just to give you uh, information about P2P system, P2P is like person-to-person -person trading. So way back 2018, walang ganitong option si Binance. So the only way for you to add token or uh, funds to your account is through ang pinakamadalas gamitin before ay coins.ph and that time wala pa yatang XRP kung tama ako way back 2018 so mahal pa yung transaction fee that time since ang kadalasang gamit is BTC so uh, other way around is like credit or debit card or your you know banking the, that time pero limited pa yung supported banking ni Binance that time so lately they launch a um, P2P system so which is you can buy or purchase token using your e-wallet or your own banking system easily to other um, person so it's like bumibili ka lang sa propa mo ng token. So, first thing that you need to set or do is just open this, uh, your Binance account. So, regarding getting your bin first Binance account, kung wala ka pang Binance account, you can check the link below. There's like a description or a link on how you can, can create your own Binance account. Um, so, pwede mong i-check siya doon sa description. So, first thing, when you click on the application, you're gonna have this home page. So, ayan, some uh, notifications above, report uh, your, your informations, your notifications in this one. And on the center, you're gonna see P2P trading or credit or debit card. So, this is like how you can add funds to your account. So on the left side, we're gonna do PTP trading and credit card on the right side. So since we believe that using our uh, Gcash or Paymaya, we're gonna click this P2P trading. Ayan. So, there's two options above, buy or sell. Siyempre, since we believe tayo, we're gonna click buy. So let's say you got funds, more likely alam mo na to kung paano mag-work kung ikaw ay seller na. So, uh, ito yung price, ito yung certain token na pwede mong bilihin, BTC, BUSD, BNB, et, ito pa yung mga supported ni P2P ngayon. Um, highly advice is uh, bumili using USDT since yan yung kadalasang ginagamit like for future trading, spot, spot trading, or other way of trading. Kasi kapag BTC or BUSD ma, uh, medyo malikot yung price nila um, volatile yung price nila bukod doon yung amount uh, uncontrollable medyo uh, maano siya mahirap siyang i-convert into peso which is more likely time Pinoy madalas na nating alam kadalasan ng palitan ng piso sa dolyares so uh, you can see here kung sino sino yung mga nagbibenta certain amount kung magkano ang benta nila for USDT and then limit Ito yung importante guys, isa sa importanteng bagay. So limit is yun yung minimum amount na pwede mong bilhin and up to the maximum amount na pwede mong bilhin. So since this will be just for tutorial, um, bibili tayo mga worth 200 pesos na USDT using our Paymaya. So that's gonna be my Paymaya. So hanap lang tayo dito. Um, advice is the smaller the, the amount is the better kasi mas mura mo siyang mabibili syempre mas marami yung mabapasok sa funds say if you're like uh, planning to invest 10,000 di ba mas mura mas, mas, mas malaki mas madadagdagan so <coughs> sorry we're just gonna check kung sino yung mura So, hanap lang tayo ng may supported. May kita mo rin yung supported na ano nila na way of payment nila kung banking, Gcash, o Paymaya. So, Palawan Crypto, 48 pesos ang isa. Manila, 48, 41. 
So, dito tayo kay Palawan Crypto. 48 pesos. Yung limit niya 70. Yung maximum niya 82,000. So, try natin. Ayan. So, you're gonna see here, maglalagay ka ng quantity na piso. May kita mo na kagad yung minimum niya. So, mag-ex out na siya. So, since bibili tayo, let's say 200. Ayan. Makakuha tayo ng $4.17. So, ayan. Click lang natin. Nandiyan yung information nila kung how, paano mo siya bibilihin. So, may susunod dito na instruction on how you buy it. Ayan. Click lang natin by USDT. There you go. Okay. Got it. So, pwede mo siyang i-click. So, check natin. Ayan. Ayan yung message niya. Ayan yung message niya. Pwede nyo siyang um, kausapin yung seller. Transfer funds. Payment. Okay. So, click lang natin to. So, hi po. I'm online. Pinimaya po. Five four nine zero two. guys. Send lang natin. Ayan, copy lang natin yung number. Ayan. So, so, ayan. 200 pesos. So, pupunta lang tayo sa ating Paymaya wallet. Ayan, Paymaya. So, let's just wait for Paymaya to load up, guys. So, so send money lang tayo Ayan So paste lang natin yung number nya Yung amount I guess alam nyo na to kung paano Yung mga may paymaya at saka gcash Ayan. So. So, screenshot is one more important thing na gawin natin, guys. Para ma-send natin sa seller na na-send na natin. So, wait. Loading lang yung ano natin. Auto natin. Screenshot. Check lang natin yung screenshot. Ayan. Send. Check natin. Tapos, i-click lang natin siya. Alright. So, please use your own account to transfer the 
Okay. So, yan. Transfer next. Pag nasend mo na, pwede mo nang i-click yung transfer next. Para meron siyang confirmation na kay, ano, kay seller. So, yan. Expect may may time frame siya kung kailan mo bailan siya magpupunta sa wallet mo 21 minutes yung ano natin time frame so we're just gonna pause this one then we'll go back pag mga 3 2 to 3 minutes na ayan so guys uh, successful transfer na yung uh, yung binili nating USDT sa sa seller so may notification siyang ganito so you can uh, have the option to view wallet balance or check order so let's try to click view wallet balance ayan na siya so ayan nandito na siya nasa so may kita nyo nasa ano siya nasa nandito sa taas P2P Ayan, 200 pesos. So, pwede na natin siyang i-transfer sa uh, designated uh, market natin kung saan mo siya gustong ilagay. So, so, ang option dito is... Ayan. Sa spot. So, USDT yung meron tayo. Okay, click mo lang tong USDT. USDT. Ayan. So, click max. Then, there you go. Transferred successful. So, may kita mo na siya dito sa spot balance mo. So, there you go guys. Ito na siya. 200 pesos. So, that's how you do uh, uh, buying uh, token or coin to your Binance account using your Paymaya. Same thing with Gcash. Magkakaiba lang yun yung transaction on how you send it sa seller. So if you like the video, please hit subscribe and the bell button. So I'm just gonna say, uh, upload the next uh, video kung paano mo siya trade naman ngayon. So sa depend sa kung anong market gusto mo, margin, future, kung anong gusto mo, uh, isolation market or margin. There you go guys, thank you so much for watching the video.